In this video, I'm going to show you how to make miniature water bottles using UV resin. Here's a list of everything I used. So I started by making these little water bottles and each one has a different shape but basically you can just make any kind that you prefer. I want to make a variety so I started with like a basic shape um, which you can find like in any grocery store and then I made something that looks a little more odd like a Pellegrino bottle which is still um, simple to make but just a little bit different. Okay, so now we're going to make the mold so that we can make the little water bottles. Basically, I took part A and B of the mold putty, mixed it together, and then made um, a mold of the little water bottle by just pressing it in and leaving the back open, and that's where you're going to pour in the UV resin. And by the way, UV resin or magic gloss is by Lisa Pavelka, and it's basically like a resin, but it cures in the sunlight or with a UV um, light or lamp and it cures in about 30 to 45 minutes versus regular epoxy resin it takes like you know overnight or 12 hours and this is really quick so where I live there's a lot of cloudy days so I got the UV lamp so I wouldn't have to wait for the Sun to come out to be able to cure these and it took about 45 minutes like I said and these I mix food coloring in. The important thing to remember with the food coloring is you have to use a mold that's pretty large so that you have a really large amount of the UV resin mixed in with the food coloring because I tried it with smaller ones and it didn't cure. Like it, it took like three hours later it was still not cured so it was just not enough resin um, mixed in with the food coloring so that's just something to think about. Here I just added some canes to look like fruit in a Voss water bottle and then this is another one that's just like a square shaped water bottle same principle and this one's a little bit round and I'm just popping them out of the molds again this one's a like a made to look like a Voss water bottle it's just a cylinder really simple and now I'm just painting the tops so that they look like they're plastic tops instead of the clear um, resin. And now they're starting to come together. They look a little more like the actual bottles. I was starting to get nervous. I thought they were going to look really ugly. And you can find the templates um, on my blog. I just basically made them in Photoshop and tried to make them as close to the realistic labels as I could but again this is just for fun so you guys can print them, use them, share them, do it, do whatever you want with them. And now I'm just adding all the labels and then I'm going to use some triple thick to glaze the labels on and make it sh make them shiny. You can use any kind of glaze that you like. Um, triple thick is just what I have and I'm going to finish the bottle before I get anything else. And I guess I have a moral obligation to say that if you do choose to indulge in the pleasure that is water bottles, please make sure that you recycle them. Also, I guess I should say I was really inspired to make this video because I love water so much. Like, I know that sounds silly. Everybody loves water. Like, you, we need it. But I really, really do love water. Like, it's kind of like a snack. Okay, maybe it's not a snack. But anyway, this is the triple thick. And here are all the water bottles in their gloriousness. And oh, they look so adorable. I love them. I'm going to make them into a little keychain and like clump up that ice, which is actually vase filler if you want to know what that ice is in the background behind them. It's just vase filler. You can find it at Michael's and people use it to fill vases or vases when they're putting flowers in them. So look for that if you want it. 
And thank you to everybody who sent me your pictures and DM me on Instagram. I really, really appreciate it. And I replied to everybody. And if I didn't uh, made a mistake, <laughs> I'll go back and check it. But thank you guys again and keep sending them to me. And I really, like, if you guys get a chance, just look at everybody's stuff. Like, it really looks gorgeous, especially, well, everything does. I can't really pick one thing. So <laughs> keep sending me your pictures and I hope you guys enjoy this video.